Havel Burek. Here's the better loot than in your wildest, Two. wildest dreams. Okay. So we got a Lugos, but that is all. That goes away. I just never like the Lacerate. Actually, it might be a good option to keep right now. Hmm. Prayers are no help early. I got no better. If we have no better, then the X-Men's are dead. <clears throat> Actually, I can kill those if I wanna. Not sure if I wanna, though. Skellige storm them. They also will not get buffed. Prefer to get in the board. Has yet to speak its last. I told you so, you idiot. Elves must die. Okay. Twister! Regroup. I can't get out another one. If I drown her, that's just gonna be just too much. But still a good idea. This... This guy need, needs one ability. To jump on the row... Actually, maybe that's not a good idea. To be able to re be repos repositioned? I don't know. Our world they just made the game very awkward with this. Everything's agile! What now, boy? I don't want to die. Really? Well, we just gotta have enough. I can play this for a 10. I think we have enough. They all. I think we want to take it to the last, right? Yeah, we have enough. I don't want to play any key cards here. We should buff the X-Men, to be honest. But if we drop their base strength to 5 and make them buff themselves by 2 points, I would be just too good. I like that they were affected by the entire board, but they can like double nerf the X-Men. I don't get that. If only I could get at another X-Men. I just had to establish the X-Men way too soon.
How do I do this? How do I generate value here? I can't even pull away his guy anymore. Not like it would matter. I can establish Harald the Cripple, but without the X-Men synergy. I'm pretty sure what deck he's playing. Rule locked X Men will always stay shit, no matter their base strength. Okay, let's just Lugos here. I make the laws here. Didn't get a lot of options here. You get out the raider now. See me smiling. I'm dead serious. Are we gonna see a troll alone? Problem is, we need to get control of the game. We can't even play two X Men's. Do not test my patience. Even playing uh, Harold was uh, unwise. We're just gonna continue to push I've a little bit. Nothing better today. Uh, I'll just go see Drifa. What do I want? Do I want? Well, we can just Grammys. We can go with Super Grammys later. What do you need? We'll greet up well. With fire and iron. Costly victory. Okay. I don't even know what I want, though. Maybe some priestesses. That's not particularly good. They did use up Shani. Uh, Are you wounded again? Actually, he used up Dijkstra too, because I have Dijkstra. He used up all the gold, didn't he? No, not, not, uh... <clears throat> hey, Adam, uh, will you use your Knight Rider deck? Next, maybe? You guys want me to do that? Should we, like, uh, switch? Kinda in the mood of, of playing this Captain Man deck. They're doing really, really well with it. It's just hard to stop if I start playing with Knight Rider. Okay, we got no better. So that's a problem. So X-Men probably should just go away. 
Store. Okay. Well, it's gonna be like a pretty unusual finish for an X-Men deck. Instead of just uh You stand before Royal Majesty. Trying to establish better and whatnot. It's just gonna be a total po power dump. We can go Grimmest. Grammys Fog is just nah. We're just gonna go Grammys Bear. Oh, actually, Grammys Bear is no good. Do I just do I just get Grammys Fog? Because I feel like the guy is gonna get out is gonna get value from uh, the armor. So by hitting the armor, we are directly messing with him. Because I'm not gonna have a uh, low strength units that I can bear. Gods, not a moment's pace. Nor I'm that strong that we can just like blow up the guy right away. I have no interest in politics. Right. We gotta play these guys first. We don't wanna override the their strength. Won't pay us in gold, pay us in blood. We actually managed to draw into the for again. that battle. I'm gonna save this for last. Oh shit! Dijkstra! Do I want that? Mm, what? Not good at yes. all. It looks a bit of a mess! Okay, I can't. I can't. If if it's a battle maiden, and it's it's dead. Burnout is not gonna get enough value. This is just not great. I don't think we should do that. I make the laws here. It looked, it looked crazy. I've been waiting a long time for this. Oh my God! Really? He. That's an exact copy paste of uh, Freddy's uh, Radovid deck. Hmm. GG. Okay, just say it in the chat. No balls. He didn't play the extra. Whatever. I lost because I didn't play the extra. And playing the extra there was probably right. You know? Well, uh, GG. Alright, uh, Brewerhag. Uh, Warrior goes away. Roach goes away. And I believe. Uh, no, good. Let's just make a pirate captain go away. However, the resurrectors are not gonna help us here. <sighs> so, how do I do this? Do I try to fight for victory here? I shouldn't establish an X-Men. There's nothing to establish here. I can make Grammist into a bear. 
I'm not even sure what I'm gonna go up against right now. This is a leader I don't know what's gonna be. Maybe it's gonna be the Dragoon deck. For I fucking hate the Ajar patch. Blind, greedy fool. Oh, there's the movement dwarf. Of course. A silly of me. So. He's gonna move stuff for free. Also, he has the Vetter Mover guys, right? Probably setting a bro is not gonna be that useful against this guy. Step away while you can. Oh, I don't get the Aja patch. Like, seriously. Like, I just don't get it. I For most things in Gwent, I would say, like, hell yeah. But one justification about that edge job patch, like, hey, we made everything edge job because in the future, like, a year from now, it's gonna make sense. That's just dumb as hell. Like, that kind of logic never works. Like, that, that was literally logic, guys. I'm, I'm looking for any kind of justification of making everything agile. I think it just made the game worse. Wow. That's a Marauder deck. Okay, and we can just keep triggering some Marauders. But actually, that's good for me. If he does that, I'm okay with it. He likes it. I like it too. Thanks. Thanks. You like it? I like it. This is a win-win guy. The you like it? I like it. Past. That's what I call a win-win. Win-win. Nice. I might just put in your Marauder for... Because Thank why not? My love. Hey, you better not. Oh, you're just making them drunk? That's fine. Uh... Mad Mel Lugos. Actually, maybe I should have just killed the dwarf in the front. Because now, now it's awkward. Okay, let's just go Gremis. Rock Curling Roar. Hey, this is total win win. And here we go. Witching is starting. Oh, what? I, I don't mean to be the, like that guy. Come on, I just brought up a topic. Hoxie, you're so hard on me. This is crazy. Never a uh, chill stream. Modern Freyr is patient. But she brooks no insult. Quite the rogue ride there. I've never run from no one, and I'm not about to start. Okay. So we can kill one of the dwarfs. With Mad Mel Lugos, and that's pretty damn good. Okay, I just do it right now. Uh, can't believe we are getting a Lugos wow. instead of what is it? Burnout, but. Let's do it.
Like, I would really love to have like a discussion about the agile patch. For me, it just doesn't really make sense. But, like, this is just like more of an open question. How do you guys feel about it after all this time? I just feel like it just... It just took away from the game. Especially feel that way if I'm playing X-Men. <laughs> Thanks. Any one I could look at the axe. Well, that sucks. Yeah, dumb bad job bullshit. What's next? The card working scrum teams. By the way, I'm not looking for you guys to validate my opinion. I am definitely looking for uh, any kind of uh, justification. Like, if you like the Agile patch, I want to hear about it. Like, I think making some units Agile definitely makes sense. But, overall, I don't feel like it's just really... It more took away from the game than just added. Elven blimey. It's gonna be a long round. That even is not gonna live for too long. But I just we serve her who is virgin. Get out, Mr. X in the back. This way, even if yes. you better counters. That Whoa. would fit perfect. Oh nice. Everyone's running those. Perfect. You stand before the Queen of Skellige. These are rule locked. Yes. Also, Barclay's rule locked. We got May more John Freya watch us and keep us for Brad. That's just way too good. I can't miss that party. The customer is king. Uh oh, ah, I've got to get this stinking mess in order. Okay, if you get stronger, I get stronger. That's the deal. I don't even care about Grimace. It needs to be X-Men. What a back row. Anything. Hope you don't have better counter. Whoa! Got a hearty hand. And this is the went. perfect game. Okay, Harald, show him what's up. To arms, all of you. Who's gonna win? The X-Men or the dwarfs who take it like a man? Guys, this is the last time to place your bets. This is close. <laughs> oh no. The customer is king. A storm is coming. People Let's say enjoy you have the a weather clear while sky. we still can. No! You don't need clear skies. Okay. Well. I do not mince words on print. Let's just drown it. I just drowned this guy in. Uh, 
What an awesome game. Everyone's getting stronger. What's not attack? bad. Not bad at all. Don't don't you fucking dare. No. <laughs> Do it. I'm killing that bird, okay? Maybe I should have waited. Maybe he would have played more stuff in the back. Probably. Maybe not. Likely not. <laughs> oh. Just that? <laughs> Lame. Lead them, Captain. These dwarfs, they think all they're all tough and shit, they're not. They're just big babies. Get the hell out of here. GG.